Hi, everybody. This is Miss Lynn from Lovely Decor, and I am coming to you today with a new tablescape that I have been working on after the um, peacock table cake, st- cable tablescape that I had made. And it's late in the night, so I'm, I don't want to start my rambling. But anyway, um, today's table, I told you I'm going to be coming with a table either um, reindeer in the forest or jewels. So I decided to go ahead and do jewels before I do reindeer in the forest. Because after reindeer in the forest, I'm possibly going to do maybe one or maybe two before I do my fire and ice completed tablescape because I have everything for it now. So without further ado, this table is called Jewels. And as we come and get a closer look up, these Right here, these balls, if you saw my last haul, the mercury balls and the blue balls. Uh, the mercury balls are from Home Goods. The blue balls are from Pure One. And I told you I was making this beautiful arrangement in this cylinder I already had in our home. And so I'm going to go up. One thing I love about this is the height that it adds and how beautiful it is. And all I did was these are from some willow sticks that were from Home Goods. And I painted these willow sticks a turquoise color that you could purchase from your area Michaels or Hobby Lobby in their craft department. It was the craft, uh, uh, craft, yeah, it's called craft paint turquoise, the color. And I just painted this and put it into this cylinder and it came out beautiful. And this will be my arrangement now that will stay on the tabletop as I do others okay and uh, right here I just use my silver mirror tray um, just to put things together bring them together bring the colors of the decanter because the table is called jewels is because it's about everything pretty and our jewelry and uh, how we love to have beautiful things on and I just placed them in here and I made a couple well I already had a couple um logo candles that I make and you can go online and get the free logo and bring it down and in this thing you see some of my Hobby Lobby Christmas ornaments that I have been showing to you in some of my hauls and these are my beautiful apothecary jars that I made that was a DIY that I made um a couple of weeks or uh, maybe a, a month ago so I took also and made the arrangement I mean I'm sorry napkin holder that you see here too and I took some of this stretchy ribbon that you can get from Hobby Lobby or any craft store you can go to and it was a stretchy ribbon and it's real nice and I just placed it around and I turned it you would usually see maybe someone would turn it diamond shape but I turned it this way because it just adds more of an effect and it's really pretty and it's beautiful and this is called Jewels. And these are some of my DIY candles. And I just think all of this looks so amazing and so beautiful on the table. I turned my tray the opposite way because the long way I think would have taken up more time. And then when this turned this way, it really draws your eye to it. I love to be inspired by beautiful things. I love all of the uh, YouTube decorating channels on here that are doing such wonderful, beautiful jobs that just make you be inspired to, to do so much. Here is my uh, tea light swan right here, um, and I placed it on the side, but I always like to have an alternative way that I could place these and do them. 
And so I want to take you around the table just to show you this is the way that I did one setting, two settings, because I like to come and see how you can do two different things. And these are my pillows, some of my pillows. How you can do it, I'm going to film from this way. I am a music lover. I love music. And I found that uh, about three or four years, this music note that you see here at At Home. And I, I, I simply love it in that area with that beautiful panel. And here you see one of my Alfred Zone candles. I'm just trying to give you a close-up. And now we're going to come around on this side and you can see a different way that I did the same tablescape but just different where I put the uh, bird mercury bird inside of the bowl and the napkin and stuff was on the side I just like to do sometimes an alternative uh, another way of doing things you know just to, just to give you a variety of what you can do with some of the things that you already have, and then some things you will purchase. Now, I'm trying to, the only thing that was purchased on this table, because were these napkins from that, another haul, and then uh, the cylinder already had, I just had something else in it. But I really, 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 really love this and how it turned out. And I told you in my last video that I was coming with a very tall uh, arrangement that I was going to be using. And I can't wait to use this in the fire and ice because this is really uh, beautiful. And I'm going to decide if I want to use the tray or not. But this is a way that you can bring all your beautiful stuff in. It really is. You can put all your stuff in and then still have a little space. I try to put the little uh, diamond gadgets and stuff on the table. Because it's a table called Jewels. This is what it's called. And I think it is beautiful. I will revisit this table. Because one thing I love about this table. Even with the Mercury Birds. You can use this table year round. And when I was preparing. And um, putting these things together. You know I like it on the side. But I, I like it right here. And it's just beautiful. I'm thinking about, I am going to purchase from Hobby Lobby their mirrored uh, trays. I'm going to purchase about uh, four of those mirrored trays because they, they are really nice. And that they would have really made this beautiful because I can see how this looks in this reflective uh, glass mirror. So I'm just going to stand back for a few minutes and... Scroll down here. This is my Lucite acrylic ice bucket. I just decided to put it on the side. And listen, if I was uh, having this table out and using this table right here um, for, you know, guests or people that's coming on, that whole cabinet space will have my shakers and it would be a buff. It's always buffet style. My tables are set, but we serve ourselves because we're family, we're friends, we're loved ones, period. So we get up and we take the time and we serve ourselves. And um, I would have had all my silver stuff up here um, on this cabinet there. Now I'm just going to move my um, bling out jaws and put my two uh, other jaws there just to show you how you can... This can be moved and changed. Well, you know what? For time's sake, I see my battery. For time's sake, I'm just going to use them in another um, setting. I'm just going to use them in another display. But I wanted you to see this, and I call this table Jewels. I want to say thank you for my subscribers, those that are subscribing to this channel. Thank you for those who are leaving wonderful comments and beautiful comments. I'm a person that is uh, drawn to 
the beauty of things and the wonderfulness of things and the wisdom of God. So that's what I respond to. So I'm so thankful to God for allowing me just to be able to be creative, you know, and just to hear the kind words. I believe that's what, whatever is in your heart comes out of it. And that's why I am so thankful for those who with a beautiful heart and a beautiful spirit, leave the wonderful comments that you leave. Because like I said before, you don't have to really leave a comment and say anything, but just to take the time to say, that's beautiful, that's nice, that's well done. Because, you know, I am a believer of, if you don't have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. So I just want to tell you, this is Miss Lynn. This is the table called Jewels. And I wish all of you a wonderful evening and a wonderful night and keep on decorating, keep on being, bringing beautiful stuff. God bless you. And I'll talk to you soon. And I will be coming. I will give you a sneak preview. I think I got enough battery time to give you a sneak preview of what's coming next. Oh yeah. This is just a sneak preview of what is coming next. Reindeer in the forest. So God bless all of you. And this is Miss Lynn again from Lovely Decor. Have a wonderful, beautiful evening.